As for the bezel design, our young SD Dang has once again spun gold. Let's see it. Wait, my signature's not on it? How can it be the Gavin Belson Signature Box 3 without Gavin Belson's signature on it? Well, the word signature has a handwritten feel to it, Why so... is my signature not on this? Uh, Gavin, there was a slight issue with your signature. What issue? Do you have a mock-up? Pull it up. Ah, yes. There. What's wrong with that? Well, reactions to this uh, from our testing groups were mixed, so we contacted a uh, handwriting expert. And, uh, well, uh, Jean, do you have the report? Absolutely. Pleasure to be on your team, Gavin. Here it is. The signature displayed troubling traits, left of upright slant, narrow angles, tense strokes, conclusively indicative of sociopathic tendencies. What? Characterized by a lack of empathy, a need to dominate, a willingness to hurt others to achieve one's goals, inability to accept bad news. Hoover, sir, get this horrible woman the fuck out of my office now. I like it. It's just so edgy. Banksy is a very edgy artist. The edgiest. What is this? Banksy is insisting his signature be on his work. This is supposed to be my signature. On what planet does a signature have a signature on it? I'm afraid it's non-negotiable. The fucking balls on this egomaniac. You know what? Fuck Banksy. We're on a campus full of literally thousands of the greatest creative minds in the world. Let's just crowdsource it with our employees. We'll make it a contest. People will feel empowered and part of the team. And it won't cost us shit. You see, this is what a benevolent leader does. Make it happen. This one came in third with 46 votes. Cute. Next. This one came in second with 374 votes. Nice, feels solid. And with 9,986 votes, this by far was Huli's favorite. Hmm, I like it. It's bold. Gavin B. 